what's more fun than a mystery box? Happy Hobby, I'm David Goss, and once again, I'm coming to you from my new house that we moved into that is just not even close to being set up for me to do videos yet, but I don't care, because I'm excited about some uh, a, couple, a few handful of things I want to share here. First, we're opening up this box, mystery box, that I bought from Target. I found it the other day. Did saw some things on Reddit where the packs that come out of this box, there's some interesting packs the past few years. Uh, some older tops in here. I, there's some junk wax, I believe. I saw some old leaf. Not the great set of leaf, but like 92, looks like, 1992 leaf. But some cool stuff in here. So maybe we'll get some cool packs. Um, who knows, the past couple of years, it's been some great rookies that have come out. So we'll see what we get. But I also want to re-mention Bowmania. It is happening right now. Right now, we are. Uh, I'm one of five YouTube channels that have gotten together to do this really cool uh, giveaway. I'm excited about it. And it already started on Monday, November 6th, yesterday. Wax Pack that the very first Bowmania video. So you definitely want to go check that out for sure. Uh, Wax Pack Dad's pretty awesome. He does a lot of old school rips of 80s and he does 70s. He has some 60s stuff on there that he opens up. It's pretty crazy. I don't know where he gets it all from. Uh, but he does some great stuff, and so he's giving away uh, some Bow Mania Insanity. Thursday, that's me. Thursday, November 9th, I'm giving away a bunch of stuff. So I, first, we're opening up some uh, handful of 1987 Tops uh, Baseball. We're looking for Tops Baseball. But I'm giving away a handful of Raw cards as well of Bo Jackson. And uh, one of my all first off, I'm also giving away these two custom cards, custom Bo Jackson cards. They're a lot of fun. They're very cool. I wish the Bucks would have gotten them. We just drafted them. We just wasted a pick, so that made a lot of sense. And then finally, I'm also giving away, not finally, but I'm also giving away this card, the score football card that everybody loves. It's one of my all-time favorites. And then also, my buddy Brent over at Brutus on Baseball, he sent me a card to give away for this video. The ProVision Fleer 1991 Bo Jackson ProVisions card. It's awesome. Bionic Bo. That's what this card is called. So that's pretty awesome. And then finally, the big giveaway. So all these are going to one person, but the big giveaway is this uh, HGA 8 1987 Tops Bo Jackson card. So I'm ripping these packs just for myself because I want to try and get that Bo Jackson card. I want a good version of it. I, don't, I have one, but it's not a great version. I want a good one, but we're giving this one away to one of you guys. So make sure you do what I was saying, comment, follow, like, subscribe, uh, social security. No, no, don't do social security. Don't do that. And then after all those are tabulated and everybody we know who commented and liked, and subscribed, November 13th, Monday, Football Guy USA, the Football Guy USA. Don't get it mixed up. He's going to do the drawing. For each of the winner of each of these videos. So you're going to want to make sure you subscribe to him. Or else you won't even know. Subscribe to all of them if you, have to, if you want to be in on it. So that's the second announcement. The third announcement. Speaking of giveaways. I'm giving away this 2018 Topps Archives rookie card of Juan Soto PSA 9. Here's what I'm doing. Some I'm calling Topps Archives Palooza. It just rolls off the tongue. It's too easy. I've got uh, Top Archives boxes. I was so excited. I love Top's Archives. So I've been going back over the past year. I've been picking up a handful of older Top's Archives boxes. For instance, this one, 2019 Top's Archives box, which has Vlad Guerrero Jr., Fernando Tatis, P Pete Alonzo Jr. Fernando Tatis Jr., Pete Alonzo. Not Pete Alonzo Jr. He's not in this one yet. 20 years from now. Um, I also have, uh, I, I'm going to have a, a 2023 hobby box I'm opening. So keep your eyes out for this giveaway because it all depends on when I get that hobby box in the mail. It's probably going to be mid-November when this happens, but I'm going to open up the hobby box first, 2023 Tops Archives hobby box. 
And uh, again, let me just mention though, I'm opening all these up. This is just for me. This is just for my own enjoyment. Um, I just want to share it with y'all. I'm looking forward to opening up these uh, and just share it with you guys. But I want to do this giveaway. Basically, it'll be the same thing. Comment on all the videos and I'll send it to a random winner. That's how we'll do it. But uh, it's going to go 2023, 2022, 2021, 2020, 2019, 2018. And then, I mean, 2018 tops archives. I'm very excited about this. Shohei Otani rookie card I'm excited about. I don't even have this card. I got to try to pull it from this blaster. So I'm excited for that. Ronald Acuna Jr. I could get the two possible MVPs from this box, maybe, uh, of 2023. We'll see. But I'm excited about it. But today we're going to rip into this, and I'm excited for that and see if it's something worth you guys spending money on. So let's do okay, it. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is open this. Let's look at the box first. So I obviously have at least one pack of 2023 tops flagship baseball in there there's eight total card packs includes a bonus item i hope it's a ceiling fan because i do need a ceiling fan in this room uh, i will say this i'm not crazy about this not crazy about the non-security of these packs in here just rattling about and i'm guessing that bonus item is like uh you know like one kind of like a one of those coins or something or yeah i'm guessing the bonus item ain't so awesome or else they would tell us hey it's got one of these awesome things in it all right let's see where's the oh this is actually just rips open like this now i was wondering because when i saw this i was like oh i wonder if someone could is gonna because there's only one box on there oh i want to mention this too there's only one box available and uh at target and so it cost it cost it was 17.99 Cannot be returned. And then I use my red card, my target card, which is a debit card, not a credit card. You can get these. Anybody can get these lot, uh, connect them to your bank account and it acts like a debit card when you're at Target and you get 5% savings. So this box cost me $18.50. So we're going to see if this box is worth that $18.50. Like I said on Reddit, they had some pretty cool, okay, this is really, they had some pretty cool um, packs in here that I thought were definitely fun enough to rip on our channel. So let me see here, it says eight packs. Let's see what we get, and something fun, a bonus item. <laughs> mm, all right, these are tough to get out here. Oh, it's got like, uh, there's some top loaders in there. All right, there you see the empty box. Okay. All right, so let's go through this. Series 1, 2022 tops. I believe these are all retail, uh, is my guess. It makes sense because it was at Target. 2022, once again. I'm sorry, 2023 tops, Series 1. So it looks like three packs of this. There's the leaf pack I was talking about. This is, I believe it's 93, 91. Let's see right there, 91, 1991. So that'll be a fun old junk junk wax rip. All right, so that's four packs. Then we got Panini Golden Age, six trading cards. Um, I saw these cards. I don't recall what these, when these are from. 2014 Golden Age features 150 card base set of gold 150 golden age legends and there's the odds of getting something awesome there's signatures and stuff. that'd be cool i've i've never opened these so we'll see about that then we have 2022 update tops chrome update series that's pretty cool another tops chrome update series and then finally oh boy here we go 2019 Tops update. I believe the 2019 Tops update. I'm pretty sure that's Vlad Jr.'s regular issue uh, rookie card, and not the no number rookie card. But I'll take a look and see what what else we can find. Then they sent us two top loaders. Those guys. Ah, that's pretty nice. That's pretty nice. All right. So uh, let me get these in order, and we'll open them up. 
Okay, so something I want to mention here. So the 2019 Tops Update Series, the best way to find out the best rookies to get in this is to go to my website and look at that article. Uh, that's the article where I look through and find out all the best rookie cards to get from every Tops flagship series ever. So we're going to move all these to the side so we can open some up. But that's the way you want to do it. You want to look at that article and uh, you'll see the best rookie cards from every Topps flagship. Now, not Topps Chrome, not any of those, but just the Topps flagship. All right, so Leaf 1991. I don't know what's in 1991. Uh, Chipper, I believe, is 91, but I don't know if it's in this. I'm going to guess it's probably not. Hey, now I got a little note. Let's do it. What? Hey, time to get Nolan Ryan. That's a good thing. We'll come to him at the end. All right. So we got the Harmon Killebrew puzzle. Okay, for which maybe this was the beginning. Nolan Ryan, no hitter, number seven. That's the that's the last one. So that's pretty cool. Gold Leaf moments. All right, well done, Leaf. All right, flip this around. Mariano Duncan. Oh yeah, here's the puzzle card. Oh, look at that bat. Okay. Mariano Duncan, Mark McGuire at the A's still. That's nice. Mitch Williams, a little wild thing action. Uh, let's see. Tim Rock Reigns, Hall of Famer. Barry Jones, Manny Lee. Wait, is Tim Reigns Hall of Famer? Yeah. Rick Aguilera, Jeff Robinson. Don't know him. I feel like there's got to be a better picture somewhere of Jeff Robinson, no? Ray Lankford with the Cardinals. Gary Carter always catching up. Pop, uh, foul balls. Bob Walk ranks among the all-time worst pitcher names up there with uh, Homer Bailey. Yeah, that's right. Vicente Palacios. Ah, oh, there's a print line. I can't get that graded. Jeez. Junior Felix and Dan Pasqua. All right. So that was, at least we got that because the rest of that was... Um, no bueno. All right, so we're going to move this guy over. The Ryan Express. And let's get into the little Tops 23 uh, Series 1. We're looking for, obviously, we're looking for some Orioles. Look for Adley. Let me pull my article here. Let me see what we're looking for. Specific. We, obviously, we know we want Adley. We want uh, Brett Beatty. We want Michael Harris second. We want Gunnar Henderson Hunter Brown. Okay. Riley Green. Nolan Gorman. Okay, let's do it. Let's do this. Wrap her up. Christian. Oh, oh, oh. You got the Stars of MLB. I think it's a Chrome one. All right. Tommy Pham. Herman Marquez. Patrick Sandoval. Oh, we got something backwards here. Tanner, Tanner Rainey. Is this a foil? No. Why is it backwards? No reason. Chris Bryant, um, no reason. Zach Thompson, also no reason. And then finally, this one's backwards and upside down. JT Real Mudo, no reason it was backwards, just for funsies. Christian Yelich, Tops Chrome, Stars MLB with Adley Rushman, Tops MLB rookie card. Let me first give one of these. <laughs> All right, so that's nice to get. Let me put this, we'll put this, these guys over here. This guy right there. And the chrome over here, just for fun. Okay, um, and these are backwards, so we'll flip. Alex Cobb, Josh Naylor, Matt Chapman, and Austin Meadows. So that was a weird collation of those cards. But an Adley rookie right off the jump. That's pretty good. John Gray. World Series Superstar. Luis Urias. Oh, hey now. We don't talk about that guy much these days. <laughs> Ooh. We'll just set him aside. Clay Kershaw. Andrew Benatendi. Alright, then we got the backwards. and then the Alright, let's just do it like this. Let's flip this. 
I'll pull these back ones up to the front. Oh, looks like we got maybe, a, I think it's a gold foil. Hey, Bobby Witt Jr. Tops Rookie Cup. That's pretty cool. I like that one. We'll pull this guy out. Aaron Ashby, Brad Keller, Christian Vasquez, Dylan Bundy, Gary Sanchez. Remember when Gary Sanchez was a big deal? Trevor Larnick and Julio Rodriguez, stars of MLB. He gets at least one. Come on. And then in the back, oh, it's a it's a 88 throwback of Cal Ripken Jr. This is a nice little Orioles break we got going here, folks. Nice little Orioles break. Put these guys down. Put this up here. That right there. Move these guys over a little bit. Give some room. All right, so those are the leaders in the clubhouse right now. One pack to go. The Cleveland Guardians celebrating probably after beating my Rays. There's a leader's card, a Cardinals card, a unmatched energy in Cleveland. Yeah, we get it. They beat the Rays. We get it. Mark Canha just got traded, I believe. Yadier Molina, J.J. Blade rookie card. Kendall Grable, we got a blue. All right, so let's do the hit. Notice the collation is different on this one, right? All right, Kendall Grable. Yandy Diaz, this guy. Come on. Come on. A.L. Batting champion, 2023. Toronto's Young Stars celebrate. Alex Verdugo, Tyler O'Neill, Kendall Graveman. Let's see what the back uh, stars of MLB. Mike Trout, that's a pretty good. Anytime you catch a trout. That's my rule. And then we have uh, Josh Rojas with the blue parallel. Um, so there. All right, so now we're getting into Topps Chrome 2022 Update Series. Now this one, obviously, we're looking for Julio Rodriguez. We're looking for Bobby Witt Jr. We're looking for uh, Jeremy Pena. A lot of good players from this set. And obviously, remember, they have the rookie debut, too. Alec Thomas, rookie. What? So he's obviously, oh, man, we got some. Some fun stuff in here. All right. I uh, got a purple, looks like. Sean Manaya. All right, so we're going to pull out this guy. Put him right there. Sean Manaya, let's go to the insert first. That's your boy, George Brett, in that, uh, what do they call the gem one? The I forget what they call that one, but the gems. Something gems. Gemity gem. I, I remember what it's called. All right. Oh, oh, we got a rookie card. Purple. Landscape. Looks awful Bobby Witt Jr. like. That's a nice one. Holy cow, that is a nice one. Man, that just, that just made this box pretty awesome with the pen signing and the tossing of the... Very cool. Very nice. All right. Well, let's, this guy's going right there. All right, set these guys up here. One more pack of the 2022 Tops Update. That's going to be tough to beat. That was a pretty good pack. This, uh, let's see what we got here. It's gonna, we're going to need a... We're gonna need, oh, we got another purple in here. We're going to need a Julio Rodriguez in here. Yohan Duran. Javier Baez. And then the purple. It's a rookie card, but it's a red. Nick Lodolo. I do like him a lot. Um, one of our one of our um, commenters is a big fan. Nick Lodolo and Hunter Green. That's a great card, too. So, uh, one of the... So that's a good one. Two fantastic purples. All right, so now we're moving on to the golden age. I don't know what to expect from these. So uh, it makes it a fun wrap in itself, right? Like you don't know. Can we put this? Apparently has autographs possible and such. You can't be a card of the Lusitania. Wasn't this, did this one sink? I'm pretty sure it sank. Northern Dancer was a horse. Okay, so the categories down here. Historical. Horse racing. Ooh, a short, a, a tiny one of Phil Necro. That's pretty cool. Pitcher, Atlanta. 
Lee Majors, hello. Six million dollar man. Fall guy. Heard of him? Yeah. King Tut's tomb. Historical. And then finally, Josh. Ooh, I do like that. That's pretty. Look. That's pretty cool. Not a lot of Josh Gibson photos. Definitely not a lot of Josh Gibson cards. That's cool. That's my first Josh Gibson card, I believe. So that's awesome. Let's see. Uh, I'm going to put him over Cal. Sorry, Cal. All right. We have now moved into the final stage. The 20, 2019 Tops Update Series Jumbo Value Pack. See what we can get from this. Now remember back then, the gold, the parallels, they were coming a little, they, they, we had not quite reached ridiculous print run stage. So you could get good cards as uh, parallels back then. All right, so, I mean, you can still, but I mean, in other words, they were much more a common, if you understand what I'm saying. So again, we're looking for Nolan Gorman. Uh, oh, wait, 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 sorry, that's a previous one. 2019 Tops Update, Vlad Guerrero Jr., Luis Arias, uh, first guy to ever win the batting champion in the National League and the American League in back-to-back -back seasons, Brian Reynolds, rookie card, Jared Walsh, Austin Riley, rookie card in this set, Will Smith, Mike Estramski, but uh, Vladdy is pretty much the one we're looking for. All right, Paul Goldschmidt, nice, nice. Nate Lau. This is before he went over to the Rangers. Nate Lowe, sorry. Uh, Wade Miley. The Lau thing. Spencer Turnbull, rookie card. Brian Dozier. Keston Hira. Joe Kelly. Kelvin Herrera. Let me see if we're getting into the good stuff. Jeff McNeil, rookie card. All-star game. Let me put this aside. DJ LeMayhew, All-Star Game. Uh, rookie Combos, Kyle Dowdy and Kyle Bird. It's a Kyle Rookie Combo. I think these are the inserts. Yeah, I want to kind of... Ooh, gold. Ooh, we got a gold. Gold. We got a gold. You know, I like the gold. All right. These are all good ones. I'm going to save those for the end. So let's let's uh, do this. Billy Hamilton. Remember that? Man, the speed of Billy Hamilton. He was something. I'm going to set these down. Okay. Uh, Billy Hamilton, home run and shutout. Vlad Guerrero Jr. rookie de <laughs> rookie debut. Look at that. That's nice. I do not have that card, so that's sweet. Another rookie card behind him. Luis Rengifo. I don't. I don't. I don't know. Let me pull out Vladdy here for a second. And then Drew Pomerantz. I'll flip this around. Javi Baez, all-star game with the Cubs. Montana Durapau. I got nothing. Rookie card. Michael Chavis, rookie debut. Freddie Freeman, all-star game. Michael Brantley, all-star game. Melky Cabrera. Curtis Granderson with the Marlins. Oh, I don't remember him being with the Marlins. That's interesting. Then we got Washington. Carter Kaiboom. Yasiel Puig with the Reds and Josh Donaldson. All right, so these are the goods. Get the here now. So these are the, these are the inners. These are the really good ones. We, we hope, we hope, we hope. Ooh, Trent Thornton. That's a nice looking card. Don't know the guy, but that's a really cool looking card. Miguel Castro. And uh, Adam Adovino. The gold. I'm saving that gold. I'm coming back to the gold. Let's flip this around. Ooh, a Pete Alonzo, 84 rookie throw. Let me, hold on. Let me get this. We got it. That's awesome. That's really nice. I like that a lot. I like, well, that should be a, a three horn one. That's a really cool one. I like that. All right. So let me put this. Uh, then the next one after that. Perennial All-Stars, All Ernie Banks. My man was a perennial All-Star. That's pretty cool. All right, so Pete Alonzo rookie card goes right there. We'll put, and then we got this gold. Let me see what we're looking at here. 
Uh, well, I already saw the last name. Is it a... Ah, uh, you know what? I saw Austin, and I was like, is it Austin Riley? No, it's it's my race. At least it's a race, so that's pretty cool. All-Star game, Austin Meadows, never to be heard from again. Anyways, so we had some pretty good cards in here. I think the Pete Alonzo and the Vlad Guerrero, those are the two best of that pack, without a doubt. We got a Bobby Witt Jr. purple Rookie debut, pretty awesome. We got the Josh Gibson uh, Golden Age card, which I very much liked. The Mike Trout, the Adley Rutschman rookie card. The Julio Rodriguez, stars of MLB. And the Nick Lodolo and the Nolan Ryan Expressly. A lot of good cards in here. We got a lot of good cards. This is, a, this is well worth the $18, $18.50 that I spent on this box. So... Let me know what you thought of this haul for $18.50. That was a fun rip, and it was nice to mix up. You know I love to mix up the cards. So make sure you go to Bow Mania. Make sure you keep stay tuned for Topps Archives Palooza. And whatever you do, have a happy hobby. I need to go back in time.